President Zane Kufado has returned home after a week-long vacation in the United Kingdom. This is the first since he took office in 2017. He was accompanied by the First Lady, Mrs. Rebecca Kufado, his children and grandchildren. Whilst in London, the President honored two public engagements. He was the guest speaker at the University of Oxford as part of his 2018 Africa Conference on the theme, Enough Rhetoric, Catalyzing an Era of Concrete Action. He also delivered a keynote address at the London Business School's Africa Business Summit. The President also attended the Anglican Confirmation Ceremony of his grandson, Louise, at his old school, Lance. Lansen College in success. President Ekufuado was met on arrival by Vice President Dr. Mahmoud Baumia and other government functionaries. Meanwhile, the Director of Communications at the Jubilee House, Mr. Eugene Ahe, says the President and Ekufuado will start work tomorrow. Speaking to newsmen at the Jubilee Lounge soon after the president's return, Mr. Eugene Ahin said the president is expected to start a regional tour of the 10 regions from Friday. He's back. Work begins as usual. Um, he chairs a cabinet meeting tomorrow. And just as what he did um, in the course of last year, where he visited um, almost every region. In fact, he visited every region in the course of last year. Um, he's going to begin um, a nationwide tour, God willing, from Friday. Um, he starts from the Bongahafu region. We start with a three-day um, three tour of the Bongahafu region, where he's going to embark on at least the, the activities he did, um, similar activities he did in the course of last year. But like the, the trip went well. Um, as we know, he delivered two addresses. First at the Oxford um, Africa Conference, um, which was held at the University of Oxford, and secondly at the London Business School, um, where he spoke about his plans for industri industrializing um, the country, moving it from being a mere exporter and producer of raw materials to one that engages in value addition and industrialization processes. He was told Ghanaians he's a man in a hurry. He just went for a week, he's done with that, and as usual, work, work continues.